Hey everybody, welcome to this episode of the Disc Golf Answer Man. All right, next one is come, comes from Christopher DeGam Fam, another DeGam fan, number 1,000. Dang, oh. we have 1,000 fans? Apparently. Wow, nice. Hello, cool dice. Slick Breeze, Emac, and Robert Insert. Fake mill name here, McCall. What? I had a couple of questions for you guys. Good point. First is, do you bag or have any discs with a lot of sentimental value? For instance, my now fiance bought me a fusion evidence that I absolutely love because of some unique colors on it and whom it is from. No matter what round, even putter only, I have to have it in my bag. Sentimental value. I think I've, I, I probably have a few in there that I'd be really sad if I lost, but you kind of, I, I don't know. I kind of get over it quick. Yeah. I mean, there's, there's, there's a couple of discs I've lost that I'm like, man, I still wish I had it. Like that Defender yeah. from the Memorial. the Memorial. It was yeah. so good. That's one. Thanks for bringing it back up. Sorry, yeah, really. <laughs> Sorry everyone. No, I have. I'll take, I, I'll, I'll take my confidence in hair and get out of here. I have. A, I don't know. If, like, like as far as sentimental, then, like I have, like you said, I have a few that I would hate to lose. Right. But as they're far not as, sentimental to you. They're they're just worth a lot of money. Right. I have some. Yeah. I have some prototypes that were given, like a Freedom prototype that actually is. I illegal to use. Illegal to use. I have a prototype harp, lucid uh, VIP. VIP harp, that uh, Thomas gave to me and a couple other people um, when they when he was traveling over here. Your and, truth, and then uh, the truth, the pre Sweden truth that uh, Eric would like to have, um, and then. But as far as like really sensible that I really think is cool on is the one I have Sebastian's uh, oh, Dimax yeah. on yep. it. I love throwing that thing and going, "Good boy, good boy." <laughs> Yeah. And then yelling at him when he's... Yeah, when it hits a tree or something. No! No! <laughs> um, so I guess that's the only one I can think of that... that now, the suspect I do throw sort of has a sentimental value because I've lost it three times. It's come back. And it's come back. Nice. In the water, in the trees, and someone finds it and brings it back to me, and it's like, Dude, it's, it's mine forever. Thank you. I don't, I don't think I have any sentimental ones. Like I have a disc. My, my main thrower, Warden, is a... Uh, that has Walter's face on it, and yeah. he's just Walter Matthau. Loving life. Yeah. No, Walter Cronkite. Oh, yes. Oh, <laughs> my bad. Nailed it. No, my dog Walter. Oh. He's so happy Sorry. and just ah, he's <laughs> he, he's loving life. Um, I thought I lost that one the other day, and I was sad, but I found it. Um, otherwise, no, not really sentimental ones. Um, yeah, 